so today we're going to be getting back on work with my ranger station. Um, so I have been kind of thinking about over the little the amount of time that I took a break, and um, I was originally going to do the kitchen with like opening drawers and everything. I'm going to still try to do that eventually. I'm not sure if I'm going to do it right away though. At least not with everything. I might do some because I really want to have this done by Christmas. So um, we're just going to be going with the flow and just kind of seeing what happens. That's pretty much how everything goes around here. So um, I haven't been filming this originally. So um, if you haven't been following on my community page and seeing like, the pictures, um, I got a piece of wood. I have painted on like his deck here it goes around um the inside floors which i may change then i took pieces of wood covered it with popsicle sticks and painted it whole way around that's the inside walls outside i kind of did the outside like a weathered look and there's the other wall as well so that is how far we got so far um so now i'm just going to we're going to be trying to finish the walls and like the permanent collar that I'm going to go with. So I have a few different wood patterns that I can work with. I have these, this blue one, this darker one here, as well as this. Um, so I'm not real sure which one I'm going to use. These boards are just too wide, so unless I want to just use that as like the floor. But still, like, it's just a very big pattern. This I got for my barn I was making for my model horses. So it's a little big. Same with this one. This one might be good for, like, some of the furniture and things. Like, just as plain wood. You want to see, like, individual boards. So that might be what I'll do, like, in the kitchen stuff. Or, like, his dresser and things. I might cover it in that. This one may work. Um, it's a nice dark wood um not too bold then i also just have this one too which is just a nice kind of i don't know or i might just keep the ground painted here i'm not real sure because i also have to cover this wall so i'm kind of originally going to keep like the individual boards kind of plain because it's just like a nice bright wood. But then I went ahead and kind of stained it, so, kind of, so to speak. To make it a little darker and bring out the graining a little more. And paint the window frames darker. So, I'm not sure. Let's see. Oh yeah, and here I try like painting the walls like that be in his bedroom so I think for starters to kind of help me kind of visualize some of this a little more I'm thinking I'm just going to go ahead and just glue in all the walls at least the outer walls and we'll just see what it looks like and kind of try to decide where we're gonna go with some of that then as well but it'll just help me kind of see things a little better so that's what I'm gonna do I'm going to go glue all the walls in and then I'll be back to see what we're gonna do from there okay so we got the actual walls up um, we have a few little things we need to kind of think about and fix up so we're probably gonna do a trim along the bottom to kind of clean that up do some touch-ups around here um, we have a little bit of an overhang kind of measure a little off so um, I'll have to expand the floors a little bit I might just run paper across like some thin cardboard then the paper on top so that um, yeah I'll just put some furniture over that anyway so probably won't even notice so that's what it looks like now so I'm gonna go take oh it's fogging there we go so I ended up putting some of the this orange paper wall down um, on the floor. So I think that just kind of helps clean up the ground a little bit, I think. Um, so it looks really good. The door can open. Kind of pops into place, that way it holds in, which is kind of nice. Um, so yeah. So, um... 
I have to run out to the horses. I have to um, do some things out there. So I'm going to take a break. But I'm going to come back then and work on this. We're going to put in kitchen here. I think we're going to have like a little eating area here. Maybe like a little wood stove here. Then I'm going to have like a little wall comes across here. I'll have like his bedroom and like a little bathroom sort of thing here. Then I'll have like a, just a sitting area. Like this will be kind of like one big room. And then there'll be like a bathroom and his bedroom here. And then there's going to be a loft up here on this side. And I um, have a little ladder that comes down up here. We'll have like a hammock and just some little things like a guest room or like Tweak's bedroom where and she would come and stay with him. And then um, I'll build the walls up there and have like the roof. And then I'll have just a roof here, but I'll have it hinged so you can close it. Then when you want to play with it, you can just open it up. So I have some lot of stuff to do yet, but um, at least you got the walls up. It actually, it's beginning to look like a building, finally. So I'm going to stop here, run out to the horses, and I'll be back soon. Okay, so now that I got all that up, I'm back from the horses and everything. So I cut out the middle wall that's going to go right across here. And then I also have another one that's going to split off these two rooms. Um, so I'm basically just going to be gluing popsicle sticks the whole way across. Um, of course, leaving the doors able to open. So um, I'm not going to film this because it's kind of tedious, but I'm going to do that. I'm not sure about the other side. We'll see um, what I decide to do then. So my storage has gotten a lot really full. So I'm going to have to kind of take a break for now. I'm going to post this video and then we'll be doing some more probably tomorrow. I'll be filming some more and getting stuff edited soon. So um, we got some cabinets done. Um, I unfortunately was not able to film this part but... We got um, the kind of fronts. These are going to be faux doors because they were just so small. You couldn't really store anything in there. We will have um, the refrigerator. We'll have working doors. Probably the upper cabinets will. And there will be lots of shelving in the kitchen. So there will be plenty of area for the mini food and everything. Then we got um, the countertop. Got parts cut out for the sink. This is what I'll be covering for the countertops. But that'll have to be tomorrow's project because I have to feed my pets and it's late. So um, I have to get going now. But just a quick overview of what we got done today. So we got the building actually up. Um, I took a break from the middle wall because that was just driving me nuts. It's too tedious for me tonight. So I'll be working on that as well tomorrow. So we're tomorrow we're going to be getting the wall in here. Have that finished. The middle wall as well. Have this painted. We're going to get the kitchen cabinets done as well. And that'll probably be all I'll do tomorrow. But who knows what else I might be able to finish. Then we'll move on to living room and all that other good stuff. So that is kind of how far we got today. Um, definitely have to do some touch-ups around here and just little touch-ups like that. That'll wait till probably the end. Little touch-ups like that. But um, that is how far we got today. This will be kind of a sneak peek where I'll be tomorrow. Well, by the time I get actually edited, probably Monday-ish or so, middle of the week. So, yeah, that is how far we got today. Also, I have a surprise toy coming up. And I'm going to show you guys how to make. i um, not sure if I'll do that after the Ranger Station update or before. We'll just have to see how it goes. Um, but it's really exciting, so I'm really excited to show you guys that. So... Probably this month will be mostly the ranger station. That's what I'm going to be focusing on because I really need this done for a surprise plan sort of thing I have ready for Christmas. So um, I really need this done like before Christmas, which is coming too quick. So we got to get this done. So I'll be doing this probably mostly the month of November. I also have an Octo Agent quiz coming up soon that I'll have posted out pretty soon as well. And I'm going to do, try to fit in one custom figure in this month is my goal. So, I'll be seeing you guys next time with more videos. I don't know why I can't keep, I have to like open this door. I don't know, that's my problem, I'm too fidgety. I'm, ugh, I gotta go run or something, I don't know. That's how I am, yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time with more videos.
Bye.